I'm gonna do a grilled ribeye with an amazing kind of watercress peach salad with some blue cheese butter. Let me just rewind that. And now we're proceeding with blue cheese butter. And when you salt any steak, make sure to give it a crust of salt right onto a hot grill. I'm gonna make a butter for this steak. So I've got some unsalted butter, just everyday butter, right? This is like Play-Doh for adults. And then I'm gonna just break up some blue cheese into it. Gabe, you know what would be good in this? <laughs> Herbs. I got a little bit of rosemary. Just chop it up. You could use thyme, so that's going right in. Man, what else would this blue cheese butter be good on? Bread, eggs, greens, the sidewalk, the hub of a cab. Let's just give our steak a quick flip. Just hit the butter right on top, brush. Whenever you're cooking, it's good. If you have something that's gonna bring a lot of like noise. We've got peaches. This is watercress. So I'm just gonna take these guys off, the lobes of the peach. Yeah. We're good. If that landed uh, down, that would have been a hospital run. All right, peaches in to the watercress. Don't salt it until you serve it. If you salt things too early, water comes out. It's like a pool. Give it another flip. Throw the rosemary on top. Grab a little, little bit more butter. Now take the whole thing off. Give it like half the amount of time it cooked for. This is a great time to kind of toss the salad. A little bit of lemon juice. Nice big pinch of salt. Nice easy toss. Ah, I'm gonna cry. If you have a bone-in ribeye, I like to stand up the steak. Follow the bone. If you're cooking, this is for you. Make it rustic. That is beautiful. And I'm kind of opening up the flesh to the world gonna kind of take in all these peaches and all this watercress. Bring it to the table like this. Eat some bread with that blue cheese butter. Crack open some steaks. Call your friend Joel. Meet me right here, joelgammon.com. We've got them all for you. <laughs>